हेलो एवरी वन टूडे आई विल कवर दिस टू कॉन्सेप्ट दो आई हैव ऑलरेडी कवर्ड दिस ऑलवेज ब्लॉक कॉन्सेप्ट इन वन ऑफ माई वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल एंड दैट वीडियो इज अवेलेबल इन द प्ले लिस्ट सो इफ यू राइट लाइक दिस ऑलवेज एट द रेट ए बी सी इन साइड द पेरेंथिस इज बिगिन एंड सो वॉट एवर वी राइट इन साइड दिस पेरेंथिस इट्स कॉल इनपुट सिग्नल्स और वी कैन से दीज आर सेंसिटिविटी लिस्ट एंड दिस वन इज ऑलवेज ब्लॉक ऑलवेज ब्लॉक इंक्लूड्स ऑल द इनपुट सिग्नल्स ओके सो हियर ए बी सी दीज आर ऑल इनपुट सिग्नल्स इवन ऑलवेज ब्लॉक मे इंक्लूड यूजर डिफाइंड सिग्नल्स ऑल्सो ओके आई विल एक्सप्लेन वॉट इज यूजर डिफाइंड सिग्नल्स एंड दिज सिग्नल्स आर सेंसिटिव टू ऑलवेज ब्लॉक all these input signals whatever we have included inside this parenthesis all are sensitive to always block and here sensitive means this always block execution this always block execution depends on th these signals okay a signal is sensitive to always block if those signals that means if the execution of the always block depends on those signals when any sensitivity list changes either a either b or either c then the entire always block immediately entire always block is evaluated immediately and this is the reason this is called sensitivity list because these signals are sensitive to always block if we write y equal to a plus b here that means y is sensitive to a and b means the execution of y depends on a and b okay the sensitivity list or the signal may include any kind of variables nat here nat means input or output or user defined signal so if we write input abc so these are nats if i write rage state so this is a user defined signals even i can write yrx this can be also user defined signal so if you want to include you can include user defined signals inside this parenthesis also okay so here this state is user defined signal if you do not mention any input signal in always block then it may generate false hardware or simulation and synthesis mismatch okay this one i will explain and this is a very very important concept okay in case if we miss any signals inside this parenthesis then there is a chan chance of generating of false hardware or wrong hardware okay so there is a concept called always at the red star so what is the solution for this one solution for this line is this one always at the red star always at the red star means here we have not included any signals in sensitivity list what we are doing here is we are asking the simulator itself the we are asking simulator to include sensitivity list for us we are not including the sensitivity list here we are asking the simulator to include the input signals for us and why why we use this one this always at the red always at the red star why it is and when it is helpful let's say we have a always block and and this is very very big okay let's say 100 lines or 200 lines or 1000 lines and the execution of always block depends on let's say 100 number of signals or let's say 1000 number of signals then what will happen that that means one by one we have to include all the thousand number of signals here one two all the signals and do you know if we miss any signal here what it is written if we miss any signal in case if we miss any signal then it may generate false hardware or wrong hardware so we have here 1000 number of signals including 1000 number of signals inside this parenthesis is itself time con time consuming and in case if we miss any signal then it will generate false hardware or wrong hardware so what is the solution for this one 
instead of writing all these signals all the dependent signals one by one better to write this one line always at the red star and in that scenario or in that case this always at the red star is very very helpful okay it is usually used for combinational logic design okay see this is the example always at the red a c equal to a or b so if we simulate this one then what will happen if there is a change in signal here if a changes see a equal to 0 let's say b equal to 0 let's say the previous value of b is 0 then what will be the c a or b equal to 0 in between what happens let's say h this one changes b changes to 1 then what will happen 0 or 1 equal to 1 it should be 1 but it is not 1 at simulation level or before pre synthesis this is not 1 it should be 1 but this is not 1 it will give result 0 because this c it only depends on this one the c is sensitivity to a only not b even if b changes in between then it will skip that one it will skip the change in b and it won't be reflected at the output so c will remain zero that means till this level whatever hardware is generated is wrong one because this is not the actual behavior a or b if we if we synthesize this one that means after this step after pre synthesis step the synthesis tool the synthesis tool know what this or means if synthesis tool find or then what it will do it will generate a or gate it will generate a hardware or gate so here input is a and b output is c now what will happen the post synthesis result will be 0 0 0 it is correct one but if b changes in between even though we have written this one a only a is there in the sensitivity list but post synthesis result will be 0 plus 1 is 1 this is the correct hardware and this is the correct correct result so here there is a mismatch pre synthesis simulation waveform and post synthesis simulation waveform there is a mismatch and this is what it is written here see simulation and synthesis mismatch if we do not mention any signal okay and it will generate a false hardware because the real hardware is this one but it maybe it generates some other hardware okay always at the red star means if any signal changes if any signal changes then always block will be entered so here i have five signals then always at the uh, always at the red st star y equal to a and b so if any signal changes let's say a b c d or e then what will happen then this block will be this this always block will be executed and we will get the output here why okay so si signals are always and, and what we have to remember another thing is the signals all these signals are written right in the right side okay inside the always block see this signal is written to the right so this example i have five number of signals always at the red star display very log if there is a signal change then very log will be displayed but let's say if there is no signal change then what will happen if there is no signal change then there is no there is no output so it won't display very log here no output if signal if signals are not changing so signal is signal change is most for always block evaluation if there is no signal change then this blocks won't be evaluated okay if you write like this always at the red parenthesis see means there is no signal here there is no asterisk here there is no signal here that, that means there is no sensitivity list here then what will happen the block will never be evaluated the block will never be executed because there is no signal inside this one because there is no signal so there is no change in signal if there is no signal it, there is no change in signal then definitely it is not going to be evaluated or executed so this one we should be aware of this condition okay this always at the red this blank one so this is all about this always at the red star and always at the red this parenthesis without having any sensi sensitivity list so i hope that you all understood this one and if you have any doubt then you can write this one on you can ask your query on the comment section and thank you so much for watching this video